Oriental Quarries Boxing Promotions, Trade Kings, Top Star Communications, Zambia National Broadcasting Corporation, and we're live on TV3, Lamasat. And thank you to Gatoma Enterprise for sponsoring the live broadcast. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, now time for our final and fifth bout, which is a bantamweight non-title fight, six rounds by three minutes. Please help me to welcome in this bantamweight non-title fight of six rounds by three minutes. Please welcome from Malawi, Aubrey Masamba. Manja, manja for Aubrey Masamba. Manja, Aubrey Masamba, manja, manja. Please welcome to the ring. Please Please. Let's hear it for no other than Aubrey Masamba in the red corner, weighing 53.6 kgs. Ladies and gentlemen, let us hear it for the Goni Warrior, Devi Mwale. Touch one, touch two, touch three. Seconders away. Seconds out, round one. There's something special happening here at the golf club in Chipata. Some notorious fellows in the building. Obi Masamba from Malawi and uh, the Police IG in uh, Lady Kajoba has assigned Constable David Mwale to arrest the Malawi. Welcome, Fox, to the last fight of the tournament. This young man, uh, David Mwale, has to his name three fights, yet to test a defeat. Obina Samba has 16 fights to his uh, name, 10 wins, 3 losses, and 3 draws. This one is poised to be extremely exciting. And this will be exciting indeed, Brian. Again, Oprima Samba brings in a wealth of experience in boxing, but Devin Mwale is unbreached so far from three fights yet to lose. And so far, he is showing that he is really a warrior warrior in this fight. Oh, that was something. That was something. The sniper has unleashed a special one. The constable. In the Zanaka Lisa is doing the country crowd. Go for a kill. 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 Go for a David Mwale is not giving up the chance, he goes for it again. He's going for a finish, this young man. Samba is in trouble. David Mwale is in trouble. Oh, yeah. And Samba goes down for a third time. In the first round, it was very exciting. Oh, 
four fights and four wins. What a man! What a man! Only age 23. And the Santa Police Service should be very proud of him. The police constable. Actually, the last time he fought on the 26th of February, yeah. it was the death on Chuala ceremony. Yeah. He couldn't manage to come here, but all he had was uh, something, a representation of Bangoni Wari. He had something around his uh, a headband, yeah. uh, a representation of Bangoni Wari. So today, at least he had the pleasure of being accompanied by the MPs. And of course, with uh, the Paramount Chief uh, in the presence of uh, this particular tournament, the constable unleashed the sniper punch, the pumpwe punch. Counted for a very set of performance that I've seen him win this particular bout. So it's four fights, four victories for David Mwali, the constable in the Zana Police 10th Pro in 2018. His fight was a non title fight against the Shepherd Wiseman from Zimbabwe, which he won by a unanimous uh, point uh, situation. mentioned earlier on that uh, on the 20th of February 2002 he did uh, fight Gongani Makoboro of uh, Zimbabwe a fight which he won once again he's a fan of uh, Zimbabwean gospel music blessing Shumba is his favorite artist the constable did pass out at Lilai on the 10th of December 2021 he's done the country crowd yeah, as well as the Zambia police And this Pantan Weight non title fight of six rounds. Coming to a close in exactly two minutes and 14 seconds. The fight comes to a close with a technical knockout with the winner going to Mungoni Devi Mwale. Also going away with the top star in the corner. And now listen to you. Watch out. Now we start the climax of this international boxing tournament which is being held in Chipata, Eastern Province for the very first time. And it has ended on an exciting note with David Mwale winning via technical knockout. Let's start by talking to Kobe Masamba. Mwai wana buwani fight ya ya. Ah, kemo inali bueno. Ungori zina 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 yuluga. Koma be next time monte zaira bueno. Zego amo. But um, what happened today? Like, this is, you've lost again in Zambia. The last time you were in Zambia, you lost. Today again, you've lost. What happened? Ah, I won't do the Yogamba Jambi. Hanning do a move as in next time. Teta Teta Icons and Ufuro. Thanks. Thank you very much, uh, Aubrey Masamba. Still remaining optimistic, and he says next time he'll do better. Let's speak to Constable David Mwale, who's just won via technical knockout. How was the experience today? Uh, so far, so good. First of all, I want to thank God. And, uh, and the sponsors and, and the command, Zambia Police. And I'm appreciating Toronto Quarries Boxing Promotion. I was very much ready for this fight. I'm now focusing for another fight. Like I, as I always say that no one turns for a loss, although everyone turns for a win. So he's also a good boxer. I can't say bad about him. Yeah, that's what I can say. So you've done four fights, four wins. You're yet to be breached. How does that make you feel as everyone? So far, I feel good. I feel good and my target is I want to become the world champion. That's my target, yeah. Come to the coach now, Mike Wivazulu, on how he feels regarding his uh, 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 boxers. How can you describe the performance of your boxers today? 
Um, I'm overwhelmed. I think I've got no way to say it. All I can say is that um, as Orientals, we've got an M. Since we started, when we formed this promotion team, you know it for yourself. We've produced a lot of world champions and the African champions, and you can see it, what, 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 we're, what we're bringing up. And for sure, sooner or later, you see another world champion coming. And also, thanking ZMBC, Oriental Quarry is our company which sponsors us, and many others have come on board to make this way. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Mike Weaver Zulu, the coach for Oriental Boxing uh, promotion. Let's hear from the manager, uh, uh, Malunga Christopher. How can you describe uh, the experience here in Sparta and what has happened? Yeah, I think uh, we have done extremely very well, and I would like to say thank you to Royal Highness Kosema for the present, and I would also like to say thank you to the provincial administration and to the government of the President, the President. President for giving us uh, an opportunity to make sure that uh, we promote uh, this very important tournament. The Minister of Sport and also the Boxing Board of Control. Uh, there are a few hiccups here and there, but we managed uh, to make sure that we put up uh, this promotion. But it can't, we cannot go on uh, without the sponsors. I think the sponsors, they did extremely very well. I'll start with Oriental Quarries, then uh, Tresky. Uh, Lamasat, uh, uh, Topstar, ZNBC, and uh, many more other sponsors who have been helping us even in the past. Uh, you can see the results. The young man here was given a responsibility to fight for the men bout, and I think we are building him up for the African title, including pressure. I'm not going to, 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 to start wasting my time with any boxer who is not disciplined. My goal is to make sure that we deal with disciplined boxers, and he's doing extremely very well. And I'm also um, grateful to Zambia Police for making sure that there's, there's still more discipline into IG. We are very grateful to your command. Uh, the boy is now matured, well behaved. Uh, we, are, we will make sure that on behalf of the country, we make him a world champion uh, very soon. Just watch. Uh, um, we have been assured by Great Kings, our main sponsor, that we are going to have more bouts, five bouts. So we have to complete five bouts. Uh, this, uh, this year, and uh, the next bout will be in Kasumbalesa, then the other one will be in Sorwezi, then we'll go to Mansa, then from Mansa we'll go to Livingston, then we are done. Uh, to the people here of Eastern Province, we say thank you very much for your support. You can see the crowd, massive crowd. We are very, very great. And to the journalists, the viewers, we say thank you very much. May the Lord protect you. Thank you. Thank you very much, Christopher Malunga, Oriental Quarries Boxing Promotions Manager. Thank you very much, Thank you very much. 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 Th